Hello there. Not a fun topic this time, but an important one. Let's talk about the security incident concerning NordVPN. Here are the key facts. In April 2019, we received information that one of our Finland servers was compromised. How? We rented the server from a data center, and the data center had installed an insecure remote management system account on that server, which we were unaware about. So an intruder used this vulnerability to gain access to this one server. No other servers of any type were at risk. The most important part is that the intruder could not use this vulnerability to access the user credential database. All the intruder could find were TLS keys. These keys, now expired, could be used to impersonate a VPN server, however this wouldn't have been enough for a successful attack. The attack would also require extraordinary access to the victim's device or network. For example, the attack could be performed on an already compromised device or with the help of a malicious network administrator, or in a compromised network. Needless to say, such an attack is very difficult to pull off, and as far as we know, no such attack has been attempted in this case. Finally, these TLS keys, sometimes referred to as private keys, could not decrypt NordVPN traffic in any way. That's not what they do. We shredded the server, terminated the contract with that data center, and began an extensive audit of our service. Even though the intruder could not use this vulnerability to access user credentials, we took this incident extremely seriously. Among other means, we now encrypt the hard disk of each new server that we build, and we're significantly improving the security of our infrastructure and will continue to do so. The security of our users is our highest priority. So if you have any questions, please read the statement on our blog, and as always, stay safe.